Here's the Wuhot, Wuhot, Wuhot JL1618. Take it out of the box here already. This is for when uh, mobile phones, smartphones that you want to use to record yourself. This is an all metal construction, and the difference between this and your typical spring-loaded plastic ones are this is meant for more of a professional use when you're going to use smartphones uh, for photography or for video. Here is an iPhone 10, and it can hold it just fine. It's very grippy, and it's locked in there, not going to go anywhere once it's in that grip. It's spring-loaded from one side, not the bottom. Here are the measurements. It could take anything from a 2.4 to 3.7 inches. Probably with the 2.4, that's the way it is now, so it's got to be maybe a slightly bigger. But then it has these edges here that could possibly pick up smaller devices. The reason why I got this is not just for my phone, but for my Osmo Pocket. With the Osmo Pocket, there's a way to... This is a configuration where I just operate the Osmo Pocket by itself, but when I remove the control wheel, and then I have another... Uh, the, the lightning pin, and then I connect it to my phone here, like so, and this is how it shows up on the phone where you can control it, you can record to it, you can use the, just like the older DJI devices, gimbal devices. But, there's nothing to keep this to the phone except for that lightning connection. This is the only thing that's connecting these two devices together, so as I'm holding it, it just slips and it's bending something. I feel like it's not very stable. Something about it's breaking. I even have the new iPod Touch, which is a lot smaller, and that still is even breaking down. So, um, DJI and some other third-party manufacturers, they make devices that, once you lock this in, it's a bracket that holds both the phone and the Osmo Pocket. And I thought this was the Wuhot, was one of those devices, because the, the party trick with this device is that it rotates, like so. On the bottom, you have your tripod mounts. So you, what you would do is you screw this into your tripod, and then you could rotate the phone, which is what it's made for. You could rotate the phone in multiple directions, whether you're going portrait mode, or landscape mode. That's what it was designed for. And it's pretty good at that. There's also a, a lock here. So if you, no matter where you rotate it, it goes 360. You hit this lock here, push it in, and then that is the locked position. And it's not going anywhere. It's fairly sturdy for the devices that you're going to use to hold it with. But that's just, that's an, that will break if you really, if you really press on it, that could break. But at least it has that little lock. And then you could move it along. Here on the bottom, there's another, looks like a quarter 20 thread. Quarter 20, then you got a 3 8 or it feels like a 3 8 Then you got some more, quarter 20s. Here, this looks like a nano rail. So if you have those nano rail, Cages you could use could mount there and on top. It's got a cold shoe Cold shoe up here So this is really like a cage for your phone Sort of that can hold the phone and multiple other devices like a microphone attachments There's pictures on the on the site. Uh, I got this on Amazon There's pictures that can demonstrate its uses, but I got it for this purpose so I thought there's a photo on on the website that has the phone connected and then it's oriented like this and oh sorry oriented like this and then the other thing and the Osmo Pocket is connected like so but can't really do that with this without moving it or I don't know how I guess it's like this? I guess you can do it like that, but it's not very... I, I have this third-party Polar Pro mount over it, so that might have something to do with why this won't work, but 
Yeah, I guess this works if you put pressure on it. So you gotta, you gotta really, you gotta push the phone in, and then with just the pressure of this, it, it stands in. But it's still not secure like the other devices that can do this separately. That has a mount for the uh, the actual Osmo, Osmo pocket, and then the mount for the phone. This one, you, you gotta jerry rig it, and it's not even that sturdy. I had originally thought with this cage I have, it's got a, a quarter twenty in there. I thought I could put. I thought I could line it up like this and then put a screw in there and then I could do that but this is the connection is lower than the center point so it'll never uh, match so that doesn't work so if you want to get the Wuhot for an Osmo pocket and phone this one's not gonna work but it will work if you just want to use it for your phone and have multiple devices. It looks like it's great for that. And only $20, uh, well, considering the other clips are much cheaper, they're under 10 But for what you're getting, I would get it, I would get this device if you are going to shoot a lot on your phone and have microphone attachments and lights and stuff. But if you're trying to use it for the Osmo Pocket, not going to work.